Welcome to the third installment of the Lumion tutorial series. Remember to click the subscribe button to receive the most recent updates on all of our videos. The third installment of the tutorial series will go over how to use Lumion Live Sync to speed up and improve your workflows. It enables you to experience the beauty and life of your architectural projects while working in your CAD or 3D modeling software. Lumion Live Sync is currently available for seven of the most popular architectural design software programs, including SketchUp, Revit, ArchiCAD, Rhino, Vectorworks, AutoCAD, and BrisCAD. In this tutorial, I will demonstrate Lumion Live Sync with SketchUp. Lumion Live Sync allows you to connect to SketchUp in real time. To enable Lumion Live Sync in SketchUp, you must first download and install the software's plugin. Click on Extension Warehouse in SketchUp. In the search bar, type Lumion Live Sync. To download and install the extension, click the Install button. Restart SketchUp after the extension has been successfully installed. After restarting SketchUp, go to the Extension Manager and enable Lumion Live Sync for SketchUp. Close the Extension Manager window by clicking the Apply Changes button. From within SketchUp, you will now have access to the Lumion Live Sync tools. Before you can proceed, you must first launch Lumion. Choose a template to start a new Lumion project. Open the project in SketchUp that you want to render in Lumion. Material synchronization, camera synchronization, and model synchronization are three areas that will be linked in real time. To enable camera synchronization between Lumion and SketchUp, go to the Extensions tab and select Live Sync Settings. Check the box next to Automatically Start Camera Synchronization. Click the Start Live Sync option to establish a live, real-time visualization between Lumion and SketchUp. This will import your SketchUp model into Lumion automatically. When you make changes to your camera view in SketchUp, the camera view in Lumion will automatically update. When we change the material of any surfaces in your SketchUp model, it will automatically revert to Lumion. This includes changes such as deleting, adding, and refining your model. This concludes the third installment of the Lumion tutorial series. By subscribing to our channel, you can keep an eye out for our next video. We'll see you in the next tutorial.